Some recent reports from the American Heart Association, nearly half of Americans over the age of 20 have high blood pressure. That is more than 122 million people. In our HealthCast today, we have details on a new treatment option for those people who struggle to manage their hypertension. Norman Bradley has battled hypertension for most of his life. But even with medications, his blood pressure remained uncontrolled. But it was always in the 130s. Always in the one, the little 130s, over 90, 140, low 40s. But it would never get down to the 20s. So, you know, it, it's just that it was always high. It was high. You have medications which are made to optimally treat hypertension. However, the patients experience side effects, and then uh, the hypertension is not well controlled and then the patients are exposed to this high risk for stroke, heart attack, and, uh, and so on. Dr. Yanis Hadzissis, professor and chief of cardiovascular medicine at UM Miller, suggested a procedure called renal denervation. With a minimally invasive catheter-based procedure, the patient is given mild sedation, and a small catheter is inserted through the groin and directed to the kidney arteries. Around the kidney artery, there's lots of nerves, as uh, we call them, anatomically, and what we go is we go there and we deliver locally uh, energy, and this energy disrupts those nerves around the kidney artery. There's no damage in the kidney artery, there's no damage in the kidney involved. Overall, the procedure is very, very safe. After undergoing the procedure earlier this year, Norman says his blood pressure is finally under control, and he's noticed he's no longer getting migraine headaches. Man, I just noticed a difference in everything about my body. It's just, it's just feeling great, man. The doctor said that this procedure would drop your percentage points by 10 points, and it actually did better. So I'm just telling you that, yeah, it worked. He's enthusiastic about that. We're glad he's feeling so well. New Health, by the way, the first center in Florida and among the very few centers in the entire United States to offer this procedure to help patients with uncontrolled hypertension.